Okay, so welcome back. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go through the three steps of finding the least common multiple of a of given numbers um, by using the prime factorization of each number. Okay. So now again, I'm going to read. I'm going to do this, and then we'll do examples, and you can see it in action. So first, you want to write the prime factorization of every number that's given, that the numbers that you're trying to find a least common multiple of. You're going to write the prime factorization of each one of those numbers using exponential notation if necessary. So if it's a repeated factor, you want to combine that and write that in exponential no uh, notation. Also, you want to order the prime factorization from smallest to greatest prime. Okay. Then two, you want to write down all of the primes, so you're going to have a list of all the prime factorizations of the numbers. And what you want to do is you want to write down all of the prime factors that you see among the factorizations. Okay? So you're going to write those down. If there is a prime factor that is common in more than one or all of the factorizations, then you want to take the one that has the largest exponent. Okay, and put it in your list. Then what you're going to do is, in step three, is you're going to basically take those list of prime factors that you wrote down from step two, and you're going to multiply them out and write it in standard form, and that is your least common multiple. And that's how you do it. So let's do some examples now. 